Yo, what's good? It's your boy Cap and G back with another banger. Y'all know the deal by now. But today we are only buying one shoe. So as always, when I buy one shoe, that shit gotta be worth it. So let's get straight into it, bro. Are you firm on the 80, bro? It's just like, uh, I don't know. What, what would you do? I just didn't see like that and shit. Um. All right, I know no one is standing there, bro. He is in his car still. Like, I ain't never done a deal where they sat in the car. But anyways, dude said he'll do whatever on the price. That's crazy. It was already 80 for the dunks, bro. And he said he'll do whatever. Come on, let's see what I get these for, bro. Jeez. You don't got, like, a price? What would be your lowest on them? Just like with the no box and everything. 65? Could you meet me at like 50? Yeah, 50. Bruh, I didn't really think he was going to accept that. My first offer is my low ball offer. Normally they say no and we meet somewhere in the middle, but he said yes, which means I could have got these for even lower, bro. Like I could have got these for 40 or something. But nonetheless, some dunks for $50, I think that is worth it. But just keep on watching. All right, so I'm doing a two for one trade for the dunks right now. He's giving me two shoes for these dunks. I know I said this last time I did a trade, but normally I don't do trades, bro. Just lately, trades been hidden, bro. So watch what I trade these dunks for. You mind if I put them on an app? It'll take like five minutes. I just need some pictures of them. Just to, yeah, just to make sure they're legit. Yeah, no worries. That's cool if I put one. Yeah, yeah. I want to disrespect your car. No worries. All right, so the two shoes that we're trading these dunks for are these Jordan 4 Alternate 89s and some Yeezy 350 Zebras eaters but honestly bro i think that two for one is worth it but y'all let me know down in the comments below is it worth it but watch till the end to get the full story yes sir uh, if they come back as a pass i'll do it bro okay. all right bro they both came back as a pass that boy was ready, had it on his hip, right in the pocket, was ready to cock it, lock it, pull it, you know, all that, drop it. Like, Jesus Christ, bro, chill. I understand on some deals you got to bring it with you, but not on deals that don't mean anything. He must have not known that I got these dunks for $50, which means that I got each shoe for $25 a pair. Come on now, y'all know that's worth it. But keep on watching because I promise it gets better. We're straight. I appreciate you, no bro. Problem, bro. Take care, man. You too. What's up, bro? And just like that, I sold the Yeezy 350 Zebras for 130 bro. Come on now. I only got both shoes for $50. And I don't know if y'all seen, but the other shoes are on my feet because I kept them as personals. So let's do that math real quick. I just sold the 350s for 130 And I only caught both shoes for $50. It's going to come out to $80 of profit plus a free shoe. Let me know down in the comments, was that worth it? But anyways, we do got another banger in this video, so let's get straight into it. All right, so a couple things you need to know before we get into this one. So I didn't really know if these shoes were real or not. Just the angles he took weren't the best. So I was asking him for more pictures, but this man was getting upset. He kept on saying I was dumb for not knowing and how to not legit check easies, blah, blah, blah. 
So I was definitely expecting that same energy when I pulled up because I knew when I got there, I was going to lowball because this man was chatting shit. So it was definitely demon time when I get there, you dig? I mean, I trust them. I've never had a bad shoe. Uh, I got that reference from a couple of like my friends that own like consignment shops. Like, uh, so they told me to use that app anytime I buy shoes, like not from a store, pretty much. Your friend didn't give you a box when you got him. Uh, so dude brought his dad to the meet, bruh. I could just tell this was a little kid because anytime I'd ask him a question, he would look at his dad to answer for him. But nah, it's crazy because this dude was talking all bold in the messages. And now when I got here, he's real quiet. So let's see what happens. Have you ever took him to like a shop to get him authenticated? Your friend just told you that they were legit? I mean... They, they look good, but like I said, Yeezys are just, uh, man, they make good fakes of the Yeezys. Uh, back when you bought them, you did a bunch of checks on them. I looked on YouTube because I was scared they were fake. Yeah. Yeah, I, I buy a lot of shoes. I still just, I trust the abs, man. I just, I don't know. I don't want to get burned over something, you know. All right, so this is probably a good time to explain what the shoes are. There's some Yeezy 350 Oreos. But yeah, I don't know why his dad added that in. Like, I was just gonna believe them that they were real just cause his dad said it. Oh, like, oh, if your dad said, no, bro, I don't care about you or your dad. I'm gonna wait for this app to come back. Yes, sir. Three more seconds. How much did you say again? I think we said like 120. Jeez. I didn't know they didn't have no box. Could you do a hundred? No. All right, so I definitely knew that they didn't have bugs, but like I said before, he was talking crazy in the messages, so I was definitely gonna get there and try it. I don't even care if his pops is there. I gotta get the lowest price possible. Yeah, they say authentic, but you couldn't like meet in the middle or anything. I just, it, the no box kind of kills it for me. Yeah, but we, we, like one, I feel like at 180, uh, but I, I get that, but like, I, I, it can't be my fault that, you know, the people aren't buying because I seen that you reduced the price in just general. And I did think they had box, bro. And like the box does add value. Y'all should already know what time and I'm on. I'm always on that demon time. I don't care what is going on. I don't care if your pops is there, whatever. I'm going to still bring that same energy. But what's crazy is this is the same energy I brought in the messages. He just not bringing the same energy from the messages. You dig? It's real quiet. I could hear the birds chirping, the wind whooshing, like all that, bro. But anyways, let's see what happens next. I, I'd be at like, I could do 110. I could meet you in the middle at 110. Yeah, I'd be good then. Like, if you can't even work with me a little bit. I thought they had Fox, though, so like I said. Huh? Oh, I didn't. No, I, I didn't know that, bro. I wouldn't have agreed on 120 if I, did, if I would have known that. I'm out of this, but my it's, opinion, it's up to you, bro. In my opinion, for what you paid, I would go to lower. I mean, I just, I drove like way out here and everything. You couldn't, you know, like I got to drive all the way back. If not. Oh, oh, yeah. My son's just trying to sell some food. I stopped in there to, uh, Yo, this other dude thought I must have been trying to rob them or something because he literally asked for help like they was all going to jump me or something. I thought that was funny. 
But anyways, yeah, they went over and started talking about some grills or cargo pants with sandals or some dad shit. I don't even know. But I knew this was my opportunity if I had one to get this price lowered. But let's see what happens. Yeah, I get you. Do you got any other shoes? I'll buy more shoes if you got, like, I don't know. I see you got some mids on. You got any other shoes you're trying to get rid of? Oh, not on you? Yeah, I feel that. Um, uh, <laughs> he said so politely, is there any possible? <laughs> like, nah, bro, that right there made it worth it alone. I don't even care about the $10 anymore. <laughs> Ain't no way this is who's talking shit, bro. Somebody better get fur because Phineas is going crazy, bro. Like, I don't know how you can be out here looking like that and be talking a big game. He must have knew his pops was going to be there. Like, he was not meeting up unless his dad was there. Because, golly, my boy... But anyways, I did end up copping these for 120, which I know some of y'all gonna be upset since I didn't talk down the price. But trust me, it will be worth it. Y'all just gotta keep on watching. What's up, bro? Yeah, I seen you. I just couldn't find a spot. Oh, yeah. No, yeah, I just didn't want to like this parking lot, this place. Yeah, no worries, bro. I'm gonna ask where you got them. Uh, I bought them off a of dude off off road. I'm a reseller, bro, so I just be buying a bunch of shoes. Appreciate you, bro. Thanks, man. Of course, be safe. You too. Ended up selling these later that night on the same day for 180. Come on now, bro. I only caught these for 120. Y'all let me know down below was it worth it? But anyways, let's break down these numbers one last time. So I just sold these for 180, and I only copped them for 120. That leaves me with $60 of profit. Yes, sir. That's half of what I paid of just profit come on now in the same day that is nice and easy but anyways this will be the end of the video make sure y'all boys like subscribe and turn on those post notifications so you don't miss a banger but until next time i'm out